Hola guys, I'm Scott Allen and welcome to Tropical Cooking Costa Rica. We're coming to you today from La Rustica Mirador in La Fortuna, Costa Rica underneath the Arno Volcano. My chef today is Milton. He's going to help us uh, make a ceviche, a Costa Rican ceviche. And uh, we've got all the ingredients here on the table. So let's go ahead and get started. We're using a, a fish fillet today, Marlin. You can use tilapia, you can use sea bass. We've already cut that up into small pieces. Uh, Milton's going to go ahead and put that in the bowl. So we're putting salt in our ceviche now. And the next thing we're going to do is we're going to put a couple tablespoons of vinegar. We're going to add our ingredients. So we've got finely chopped onion, finely chopped red pepper, not spicy. And then we've got finely chopped coriander or cilantro. The cilantro is how we say it in English or culantro here in Costa Rica. Of course, we're going to toss it a little bit. So, Milton's going to mix that a little bit there in the bowl. Mascarla. And I like to do this before I add um, my other ingredients in the lime because I really like the, the cilantro, I like the pepper, I like the onion to really mix with, the, and there's the vinegar in there, and really coat the fish with that. You can see everything's really nicely mixed there, right? Okay, now Milton's going to go ahead and add the lemon juice. Okay, I should say lime juice. Uh, we don't actually get too many lemons here in Costa Rica. We're all about lime. So now it's important to remember with ceviche that you're gonna the ceviche is gonna cook in that lime juice. Okay, so we're gonna make this and it's gonna sit for a while because you've got to give it time to cook because we're using raw fish. So the lime is now in there. Okay, guys. So now we're gonna put in the sugar and putting the soda water in. If you take a look. Uh, you can see how it's really reacting. You can see the, the, the bubbly of the carbonation, okay? But you don't want your, your ceviche too soupy, okay? So you put just enough in there. Okay, now we come to our secret ingredient uh, here in Costa Rica anyway. So we're going to put in some ginger ale. It's a similar process with the, with the carbonation of the, the soda water, but the, 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 gin, the ginger part really does add a nice flavor to the ceviche. And it's just a hint. And it also adds to the sweetness. So, because you've really got to counteract uh, the lime, there's a lot of lime that's going on, this is going to cook in the lime, and, um, and basically here, we've got our ceviche. That's everything we need to do at this point. Okay, you guys can see this, come and take a look. This is what it is. It's a little bit of a fish soup looking thing, only it's cold. We're back, and we've got our ceviche, we've got it out of the refrigerator. Uh, we're now going to go ahead and, uh, and really make the plates. It's very traditional to serve uh, tortilla chips with the ceviche. Here's our ceviche, okay? Here in Costa Rica, we do a little bit of flair on it. I like to add fresh avocado. Okay, guys, one thing left, and that's to taste it. Let's see how we did. Um, take your chip. Dip it in. Little spoon here. We're going to get a little piece of the avocado. Put it right on top. Guys, thanks for joining us today. Really wish you could be here to uh, to try the ceviche yourself. Oh wait, you can. Come to Costa Rica. We're here waiting for you. Pura vida. <laughs>